<clears throat> English, uh, English, math, face geometry number three, 11, 11. Looking at pages 22 and 23, and uh, this is theorem 17 and 18. In order to understand these, you need to look at the diagram at the top of the page explaining right side and left side of an angle. And uh, it says, pretend like you are approaching as the, um, the angle right at the vertex, okay? So I'm going to just take a random angle right here. Let's say I'm at that angle. And I'm trying to decide on that angle which is the right side and which is the left side. So you have to position yourself right in the vertex looking out, okay? And so your right hand would be on this side, R, and your left hand would be on that side, all right? Let's take an angle down here. Let's say we're talking about this angle, and we're trying to decide which is the right and which is the left. So you position yourself right in the vertex, and if you were standing there and you would reach out with your right hand, you would touch the right side and uh, facing away from it, so your back's in the corner, your left hand would touch the left, your right hand would touch the right, okay? So that helps us with theorem 17 that says, if the sides of one angle are parallel to the sides of another angle, right side to right side. So this one is right, left, okay? So notice this one is right side and this one is right side. Are they parallel? Let's see, yes, they are parallel. And left side to left side. Are these two sides parallel to each other? Left side to left side, yes. So the two right sides are parallel, the two left sides are parallel. If that's true, okay, if we meet that condition, then it says the angles are congruent. So we can therefore conclude that if these lines are parallel, which they were drew them to try to be parallel, then uh, this angle here is congruent to that angle. Now let's look at 18, that's a little different. I'm gonna erase this one down here. <clears throat> if uh, sides of one angle are parallel to the sides of another angle, but in this side, this fashion, the right side to the left side, okay? So down here, right side, so I'm gonna stand right here, and this would be the right side of this angle, this would be the left side, okay? So, right side to left side, see that? The right is parallel to the left. And then on this one, the left side is parallel to the right side. And therefore, these are not equal, but we would say they are supplementary, okay? And they show one diagram below that to kind of illustrate that. And then, if you look at page 23, and uh, they have you list several pairs of alternate interior angles, alternate exterior, corresponding angles, vertical angles, and then the challenge lists two angles that are congruent because angles with sides parallel to right side to right side and left side to left side are congruent. All right, so that's not this type. That would be you're looking more, you know, something like this or maybe like this, okay? Looking for an angle like this and an angle like this where the right side is parallel to the right side, the left side is parallel to the left side, but they're not, um, they're not real close to each other like this, all right? So a lot of words there and try to discern exactly what they're talking about, but that's why it's called a challenge question, okay? So read it carefully and then look back at the diagram and try to find one that meets something looks kind of like this, kind of meets that condition.